only tri-state forecast that's independently certified most accurate. Here's Mariah Turner. Well, we do have a pretty soggy seven-day forecast, so definitely going to the Newport Aquarium will be something that you will want to put on your to-do list. You'll want to stay indoors for some of the showers that we do have coming our way. But our almanac showing us today, our high should be around 69 degrees. We're going to be below that today due to some cloud cover. And I also want to show you sunrise this morning, 742, sunset 709. So our days are getting shorter. But again, that cloud cover today will help us stay only in the 50s. We'll see highs around 59. And taking a look outside, you can see a pretty gloomy, kind of day, but we did see some sunshine earlier this morning before the clouds pushed in, of course, ahead of the showers as well. Always tag us, WLWT, hashtag WLWT. We want to see your photos. This one was uh, from Shelly Neal. She sent this beautiful sunrise this morning in Union, Kentucky. So remember, hashtag WLWT. We want to see your photos, and especially with all the crazy weather that we've had this week and the blood moon even, lots of fun things to see. Satellite and radar, you can see the stationary front that will be keeping the showers in our area for the next couple days. But this high pressure to our north will start building in on Saturday, making Saturday one of the drier days that we'll see in these next few days. Right now, locally, we can see some showers starting to push into our viewing area, mostly sprinkles around town. We'll see some shower activity build into the afternoon, but we're looking at a scattered pattern for today. More showers into Friday. Right now, 55 degrees, so pretty mild in our afternoon hours. We're going to climb into the upper 50s today. Some areas could break 60, but all in all, still a very much below average kind of day. Locally, we're seeing these temperatures 60 or 53 in Oxford, 55 in Alexandria, and again, 54 out in Versailles. So a pretty mild afternoon. Again, these clouds are going to be hanging around for the most part today, keeping our temperature is fairly low. The showers will be arriving this afternoon and the scattered activity will hang with us through the evening and overnight tonight. We'll see some heavy rain as you can see on Futurecast tomorrow morning. But the clouds again are sticking around for the most part. You can see showers starting to push in right now. Here we are on Futurecast Friday in the morning. We see showers becoming more heavy, especially around commute time. We're going to see some wet roadways tomorrow morning. And as we push into the later hours on Friday, you can see how the showers are tending along and south of the Ohio River. So some of the high school football games tonight, I'd say you could see a sprinkle, but the future cast is starting to trend more so in that sprinkle direction with some scattered showers remaining to our south. So it's starting to look in favor for high school football. But again, as we push into Saturday, our weekend, we see some high pressure starting to make its way in. Clouds you'll see start to dissipate as well as the showers. So Saturday, again, looking like one of the most dry days that we have on the way. Again, today, 59 degrees. Pretty cool and a little bit below average with those scattered showers hanging around. As we head into our overnight tonight, it's going to be chilly in the upper 40s with that rain likely overnight tonight and through tomorrow morning. Starting off soggy tomorrow morning, 57 degrees. And again, rain will help last until about the afternoon. It'll start trending south. And let me break down tomorrow for you. Your Friday, you can expect scattered showers for the most part. And again, they'll start trending south. Highs around 57. And then as we take a look at our seven day forecast, you can see a decent chance of rain every day of the week.